Steps 1 to 8 are primarily focused on house cleaning, clearing up the damage from the past. Step 9 moves into the present and urges you to find out what you love to do and share it with the world. Optimal living is contingent on you being fulfilled and joyous. Living on purpose is the best way of ensuring success. When we open to our inner guidance and flow with the current of intelligence which flows within us, our purpose is illuminated and our lives change forever. Your life's purpose doesn't have to be some monumental fate. It may simply be a series of small things carried out with much love. But one thing is for certain, it will fill you with inspiration, enthusiasm and delight. Once you're on purpose, your life will change forever. The essence of this step can be summed up in the following statement. Love what you do and do what you love. Your life's purpose is relayed through the language of the heart. So feel your way into it instead of thinking. Identify what excites and stimulates you. Identify what sets you alight inside. Maybe your purpose will reveal itself in a number of stages as it did with me. But every stage will be inspiring and stimulating. I guarantee you. Your life's purpose is a desire of the universe waiting to manifest through you. I cannot think of a more befitting way to relay the joys of this step other than reiterating those magnificent words of Pantanjali. When you are inspired by some great purpose, some extraordinary project, all your thoughts break the bonds. Your mind transcends limitations. Your consciousness expands in every direction and you find yourself in a new, great and wonderful world. Dormant forces, faculties and talents become alive and you discover yourself to be a greater person by far than you ever dreamed yourself to be. To conclude, your life's purpose will bring you great happiness. When you live a happy and inspired life, you have nothing to escape from. When you have no need to escape, drink is redundant. The following audio file will elaborate on step nine. Just let that move up a bit. And we come to step 10. This is good news, this man. This is good news, man. Step 10, complete. The final phase of this philosophy for optimal living is maintenance. Rather than being a chronological process with a beginning, middle and end, this philosophy is ongoing. It is a way of life. To maintain and evolve your well-being, I suggest you start with meditation. Here, here are some of the major benefits of step 10. Here are some of the major benefits of step 10, which advises daily meditation. When we meditate daily, first of all, we have reduced stress. By detaching from the field of activity, thoughts and actions, we become an impartial witness to life. From this dissociated perspective, worries and anxiety pale into insignificance. We observe them rather than our own. 
we observe them rather than own them. This practice radically reduces stress and promotes harmony and balance. Next, replenishment. Spending 20 minutes in a meditative state gives us the equivalent of eight hours sleep. Clarity and concentration. Our ability to concentrate is affected by the constant chat of our our ability to concentrate is affected by the constant chatter of our inner dialogue. Meditation promotes one-pointed awareness. In our normal state of consciousness, our thoughts are scattered and diffuse, which leads to confusion and irritability. In meditation, our awareness becomes laser-like, supremely concentrated in the present. In meditation, our awareness becomes laser-like, supremely concentrated on its object of focus. Focus and solely on the present moment clears our mind, increases productivity, improves our memory and enables us to become effective decision makers. And enables us to become effective decision makers. Next, the health benefits. Numerous studies have proved that meditation improves our health. For example, lower levels of stress and anxiety due to meditation diminish the probability of heart disease significantly. Mind and matter are inextricably linked. Mind and matter are inextricably linked. Emotional turmoil often translates into physical ailments. Meditation. Emo